Hey YouTube, welcome back to Kathy's Camper Life. And Happy New Year to everyone. Happy New Year. It is 2021. And oh my gosh, how good does it feel? I just woke up this morning. Ah, just in so much, uh, so thankful of what we have in store for us this year, I think, and uh, politically, and with what's going on with the pandemic, and ah, oh, gosh, you just have to wake up today saying 2021 is here, and 2020 is behind us. Ah, so nice to say. So, I hope everyone had a fun and safe New Year's Eve last night. I know it was a little... Uh, a little different this year seeing New York all empty and everything was really really strange but I hope um, I hope in some way you got creative and celebrated uh, with someone you love and if you're out here alone like me just uh, celebrated with my dogs and uh, just uh, in celebration of where I am as you can see behind me I'm still in Quartzsite, Arizona having a great time here um, my last video I had just gotten here a few days and then I took that video so uh, I've been able to really tap into the amenities of uh, being here in Quartzsite and that is uh, receiving my Amazon packages and my uh, Chewy because one of my dogs is on a special veterinary prescribed diet that I have to get from Chewy so uh, when you're a nomad that can be challenging but so far I've, uh, I've done a great job but anyway so it's uh, the place is called quiet times so that's where you want to go in Quartzsite to uh, receive packages and they receive uh, UPS and FedEx and probably that there's another carrier too I can't think of the name right now I'm sure they receive them too but uh so that's Amazon FedEx is Chewy and uh, there's a post office for the USPS they don't receive anything uh, of course uh, that way so uh, you know Amazon and Walmart and things like that uh, quiet times an average box costs three bucks so uh, that's been a great uh, a great resource out here um there's a place on uh, main street the main laundromat it's a huge laundromat and um, one side laundromat one side is a cafe and there they have showers so lots of showers they they keep them really nice and it's eight bucks so uh that is in Quartzsite, the main laundromat. So that is where you can do your laundry. Um, there's a place called RV Express. And it's right there on 95. Um, if just, you know, right there in Quartzsite. And uh, that's a really cool place. So they have well water. They have salt-free filtered water for drinking. Propane dump station excuse me looking for my dog she's out there somewhere she blends in with the desert uh, dump station uh, I think I said propane so it's kind of a really cool one-stop shop you pull in there and you go to whatever island you need you get all your resources uh, it's uh, a dollar for four gallons of water and I don't know what the well water cost is because uh, I didn't get any of that, but it is filtered well water. That's RV Express in Quartzsite. Uh, the best grocery store, Roadrunner, Roadrunner Supermarket, right across the street from the laundromat. So they had a really nice deli making cheese and, and, and meat trays and um, had some artisan products in there. and. Uh, uh, really small really cool little grocery store here in Quartzsite it's called Roadrunner 
And so that's where to get some groceries. So packages, groceries, laundry, shower. Um, you getting your pizza or you guys that like to uh, have a drink or two. Uh, Silly Owls is the place to go to get some good pizza. And uh, haven't been there yet. And there's another restaurant called the Family Restaurant that is uh, really, really good. So the fast food places, there's like a, there's like a uh, Carl's Jr., there's a, a, a McDonald's, and there's a Burger King out here. It's so funny, you go there, you get like a, a, a meal, it's like $10, so it's, it's like uh, resort prices, you know, for the, for the fast food. I feel like you're in an airport or something. But anyway, uh, so a little price gouging going on uh, when it comes to that. Um, I don't know if they're having the RV show or not this year. I really don't. Uh, I don't think so. But still, down there where it goes on every day is just like this huge flea market. I think it's year round. I don't know if it's just winter or what. But I mean, you can find everything in this flea market that you could imagine and uh, you know if you don't have solar yet and you're looking at to, to add some solar to your rig this is the place to do it so everything you need uh, I think Bill Solar is the is the is the guy to go to for um, uh, Installing the solar, which is, you know, a lot of, uh, most of the hard part is the installation. So, anyway, so, solar, come down here if you don't have any. I mean, the best prices, and uh, you have just great resources. But, um, so I've stayed at a few places. Uh, High Jolly was too crowded for me. Uh, Pomosa Road. I like very, very much, and I also like to Dome Rock Mountain very, very much. Dome Rock Mountain, oh my gosh, the sunsets and sunrises are just incredible, and so are the stars. Um, so just been having a really great time here in Quartzsite. I spent Christmas here alone with my dogs, New Year's, um, but uh, via technology was able to be close to my family uh, and send our love and celebrations so that was nice and I love y'all and uh, my dogs are doing great my last video was little river and she's doing great you want to say hi river she says hi hi oh she's gonna do some talking and there is Maggie Maggie she's going somewhere real slow moving <laughs> So, Quartzsite has been just awesome. The, the, the weather is just, I mean, it's gorgeous weather, uh, but at night, uh, it's about, it's in the upper 30s. It, it's chilly at night. It, it is chilly. So, uh, that's kind of been the weather, the 60s, maybe, uh, you know, uh, early 70s uh, during the day and about 37 at night. And uh, it's been comfortable, but you need some heat or some nice, uh, you know, 30 degree down sleeping bags or something. But uh, I haven't missed a buddy. It's been doing good. And uh, so that's been my, my experience in Quartzsite here so far. It's been really, really beautiful, but um, it's getting a little crowded for me. So, um... I am going to be moving on to 310 to Yuma. 310 to Yuma. You guys that know movies, you always hear me talk about movies because I'm a big movie fan. Uh, 310 to Yuma is a big famous western movie. I think it was redone too that was really good. Anyway, so I'm ready to move on as this place gets more crowded and more crowded. It took me 
a good five minutes to pull out of Main Street yesterday because of the the traffic and uh, that's you know that's not what I'm looking for so uh, beautiful experience here but I've still got a lot of places to see in Arizona and uh, 310 to Yuma's next so thank you guys for tuning in and um, I'm sure I'm forgetting something to tell you guys about Quartzsite that I'll I'll add in next videos if you guys have any questions on you know uh, where to go what to do you know what I've seen in Quartzsite put it in the comments and I'll be happy to answer them and um, again to my new subscribers thank you so much for tuning into my channel of my travels boondocking through our beautiful country right now seeing Arizona and I've got some great videos of uh, boondocking New Mexico if you haven't seen it go to my channel um, if you guys are watching this video you want to check out my channel just hit that subscribe button and uh, you'll be subscribed you'll get notifications when I when I put up a video and uh, most of my videos are you know great scenic travel videos so subscribe to my channel it's fun <laughs> all right well thanks for tuning in it's so good to see everyone and do a video and i hope you're doing great happy 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 new year and uh, i look forward to seeing you 310 to yuma may the sun light up your days and the stars light up your nights until next time youtube take care